My name's James Kerr, and for Freefall I'm doing a performance titled Sub Rosa, which uh, in a sense is a bit of a meditative exploration of um, my personal relationship, as in my intimate relationship, and the idea stems from the translation of Sub Rosa under the rose and its symbolic reference in uh, Greek mythology and um, different periods of time over history, meaning that it, uh, it had a lot to do with secrecy and the idea of this, the secret meeting. Um, so the, the play that I'm, I'm using is that I'm using the rose and my own gestures with the rose as a way to um, look at my personal relationship with my partner and the way in which intimacy plays out with that and also with our other interactions with other people. Um, so yeah, I guess the, the rose is an obvi obvious symbol of beauty and love. In terms of gestures in the performance, I'll be meticulously deconstructing the rose, so de-stemming the petals and, and throwing the petals and actually physically being underneath the rose and sort of looking at that idea and playing on intimacy, I guess would be the best way to look at it. I guess, I mean, the environment itself is a nice way to test the ideas, to test the performance on the general public who may not necessarily be aware of performance art or aware of the type of practices that are involved with freefall and to gauge reaction and to see what works and what doesn't work and to sort of, with, with the potential of polishing the performance and looking at it, at it reflecting through other parts of my practice as well. A lot of the work that I've been trying to focus on at the moment is about exploring different evolutionary traits in nature and different species um, of plants. And uh, the idea is that I want to create a like sort of a mirror with those species and the and the relationship and the way in which the relationship evolves over time. So, say for example, if there's a particular pressure that's placed on a species, that will force the species to evolve and change in the same way that it would force a relationship to evolve and change if there's a pressure placed on it. So I guess it started off looking at nature and appreciation of nature and now mirroring into, the, into looking at the relationship. 